Hey, I'm Kyle with DIY Garage Door Parts. I'm here to show you the uh, Lanier Multicode uh, receiver and transmitter. Uh, these are sold in a combo or you can buy them individually. Um, what you're looking for is on the back of the motor head, uh, there'll be three screw terminals. Uh, these are traditionally used on older style openers. And so your terminals will lock down here. Uh, on the back it will say 300 megahertz and this is what picks up the signal from your remote so if you see multi-code and you look on the back it will say 300 megahertz um, that's the receiver you have if this has gone bad you can replace this out we have these in stock and then also here's the compatible transmitter uh, 300 megahertz um, but on the inside underneath this cover there's 10 dip switches and uh, you have to set those exactly the same as on your remote. Um, I'm going to take this one off. There's the 9 volt battery that this takes and then here's the 10 dip switches. Just make sure those are set the same as the receiver. This, so this multi-code receiver is compatible with most any uh, old, older style opener. Um, what you're looking for though is where these three screw terminals um, They'll, this will slide underneath of it. The only difference on the newer newer style openers, the terminals are wider apart, so this won't work. This requires uh, 24 volts to make it operate. So if you see a box of some sort on the back of your opener, this will be compatible, and this is still available and made. Uh, the multi-code st still made um, on a regular basis. So there are a lot of obsolete models of receivers and remotes like Micon, Pulsar, and some of those. So this will be a great replacement and good remotes for that. So check us out at DIY Garage Door Parts where we ship out fast and we ship them out within 24 hours or the next business day.